Hello everybody, uh, this is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer and uh, this is my subject today. I shot this image for a couple years ago. And I'm ready for this image and also I made by Adobe Photoshop, used a filter called Find Edges to make this line drawing type image. I'm going to use two images together to get something new watercolor image on this layer. I just moved in between these images. I'm going to turn this line drawing type, change the blend mode to darken, and uh, then the opacity to about 50%. Then uh, I'm going to turn this one down too. So I can put it on here, watercolor, to make another image. Well, let's get started. Uh, okay. Choose that uh, nice, healthy skin tone on this first, about this much, and uh, use the brush, watercolor brush. Uh, watercolor wash flat and uh, that's too big and flows about 60 size is well about 100 maybe a little bit bigger okay now I'm gonna put it on over her face from okay let's see more turn down about 15% or so okay I'm going to put a little bit dark shadow side about the ear and uh, well pretty much fine and go with the hair now take a look good luck on this hair color brownish light area highlight area and shadow side brown now okay choose the little bit light well, I go with the watercolor wash flat again and uh, make it just small to put this just to touch a little one highlight side I see some blue or color here and orange here so I'm going with Uh, overall kind of dark image so go with this side and uh, blend it in here I'm going to turn this one down it's hard to see but let's see you kind of see the blending in here you see who's the color that's really I like and I want this blah um, just a touch I'm gonna make it real small mm, that's nice okay and blend in same thing blend into uh, some blue that okay you see the color here nice now I'm gonna dry oops this one dry and then I want this shape of the fan Japanese fan to make some express well on this shape but I don't think I have the turn this oh I see the pencil line here huh Okay, in that case, I'm going to exaggerate turn these lines here later and then put the color on here. I want to see this now. Some blue or purple. That's, I think it's beautiful. So, okay, I'm going to go with it. With these nice colors. 
I can't pick up from here. Light purple. Just touch more bluish, I think. Okay. Select the basic watercolor brush. Change the watercolor wash flat and then go from you see this here it's already oozing that's cool that's nice then going maybe a little bit dark that's great Now, see the shape of the fan, that's nice. Now, I want to have this hand, little dark side, but uh, I want to put just like... Okay, I'm gonna put some skin tone real softly. I'm gonna add some water to blend it in and go for basic watercolor to blend in only give it water I'm gonna make empty mask to uh, show some underneath of the base image so don't paint it on so much detailed Okay, now just to touch a darker fans area. And then just touch more darker. Okay, add some water to blend in. Just see some oozing shape. I guess that's enough for this. Now I want to put some these flowers on our head. Turn this one down. We have some cream. What color is this? Go now. I won't make light background color. And uh, with a little dark orange. And some blue. I have some red kimono colors here, so uh, Now I'm gonna make create empty mask on this, then invert. I'm gonna reveal on this mask now with painting to color fill. Let's try this to reveal. No, hundred percent. Is that yes? It's working.
Now I'm gonna go hide some this line image, block lines, same time. So I'm gonna create empty mask, then invert mask. Now same time I'm gonna reveal on this. Capacity 100 so I can see more these lines. Just like I am drawing on pencil type. Just review some. I think that's all I need now, but I want to add some pencil image here, fingers type. Now, I'm going to draw this more, I mean the review on this, make it more clear. I may paint him, I should paint this face, just like watercolor on this, this kind of texture. Maybe that's better to have, so I'm gonna hide some. Then try to paint it on her face. That I think goes well, especially this. Okay, now wait. Okay, about this is some review. Mm, not that exciting. I'm go right down more. Balance wise, kind of head is too heavy. Goes to some kind of heavy. Look, isn't it? I want to make it more lighter. Let's see if I add some color on back. Maybe this color doesn't go well. I may change this. Maybe add some more red. Okay, I'm gonna add the layer. Let me add this. I must see this color to be Maybe brownish about here. Well, let's see. Check this color. Then take this off. Take this one off too. Then I'm going to add some layer on here. Okay, I'm going to turn, I mean, uh, delete this layer and also, hmm, that's interesting, delete, I may need some color on this here only, so, okay, I'm going to turn this one off now, then about this layer, 
just erase these colors only use this kimono color on this here and turn this one on back this one maybe down tone down just touch okay that's my first time to use this kind of yellowish brown color on the background for this kind of portraiture mm, I don't know about this much I don't care about that but let's see yes I need to touch up some more the detail and also her face I will walk out later and uh, I may put some last part of this video well this is it for just now and uh, thank you for watching my video i really appreciate to support me to watching my video see you next time bye now ciao